The City of Toronto is launching a pilot program bringing food trucks into the city parks starting on August 1st. City Councillors Josh Cole and Mary Margaret McMahon rolled out the pilot today in Nathan Phillips Square. The councillors are optimistic the pilot project will become something permanent that will allow food trucks in parks and also on city streets. Well, we're uh, launching a long, I would say, long overdue pilot project to actually get some food trucks into, uh, into the city. And so we're going to start with uh, 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 select locations with about 15 food trucks offering Torontonians what I think they've been uh, clamoring for for a long time. The lines here prove it. And they do it in other cities, so why aren't we doing it in Toronto? What are we afraid of? We just need to show them that it actually augments their business, that Torontonians want it, we want to free the food trucks and free the consumers. No, I actually think that, um, and what, what the pilot will show, is that it actually brings more traffic, more foot traffic and activity to areas. So I think in the end it helps brick and mortar restaurants. And it's a different offering. It's, it's not, someone who's going to stop for a burrito is not the same person who might want to sit down for a full lunch or, or dinner. And so I think they're actually quite complimentary and I, I'm, I'm fully confident the pilot will actually show that. Street food has been a contentious issue here at Toronto City Hall. Most people remember the Toronto a la carte program that burned Mayor David Miller's administration pretty badly when it flopped on city streets. Everyone involved in this food truck pilot are hopeful it will leave a good taste in people's mouths. For the Toronto Sun, I'm Don Pete.